Eric Scarcella here with designated hitter Steve Sussdorf. Uh, Steve, you're a railroad house player of the game, two for four with a home run in the eighth inning. Uh, tonight, team lost three to one, first loss of the year, but you know, you, you can't really you know be too upset. You guys are still five and one in the year. How's it feel to be part of one of the best records in Reading baseball history? Uh, it feels pretty good. A little disappointing tonight, um, losing that one. But uh, Pettibone went out there and, and gave us a great start and kept us in the game, and and we almost came back at the end. Now you guys have been doing a lot of things right. You're leading heading into the day. You're leading the Eastern League in hitting. Um, what do you think you guys can improve on tomorrow to you know hopefully get the series win and uh, you know leave baseball town with a win? Uh, you know probably just jump out to that early lead. That's what we've been doing a great job of. Uh, I mean luckily we got great starting pitching, throwing up zeros early in the game, and uh, and I would say just for offense just to just to do what it's been doing the the previous five games. And that's jump out to that early lead and, and keep extending the lead uh, as the game goes on. Now as one of the uh, veterans of the team, you've been you played in Reading last year, and there's been a couple guys on the team. That have played in Reading. Uh, what's the best thing that you could tell these guys to do? You know, keep their heads up. You know, heading into tomorrow. Uh, just to treat it like it's, it's just another game. You know, just forget about this game. Uh, baseball, you gotta gotta have a short-term memory. Whether you have a good game or a bad game, and uh, and just come out there tomorrow and and try and win that series. Thanks, Steve. It's Eric Scarcella here after a 3-1 loss, first loss of the season for the Reading Phillies. Send it back to RTV, and uh, hopefully we'll have another great night in baseball town tomorrow.